everyone i hope you're well welcome back to my channel or if you're new here my name is seppi and today i thought i would vlog my day trip for you guys i am day trip i made it sound so much more um holiday than it is we're actually just going into central with my mom uh we want to go into central london to get something to eat and also to shoot some content for you guys and have a walk the weather is so beautiful in london today it says it's 11 degrees celsius um but the sun is out and it just makes me feel so much happier so even though we're in lockdown i'm just so much more positive and yeah just in such a better mindset thanks to the sun and like the good weather and i just want to take advantage of it on my day off even though like i'm still kind of working but i don't know i enjoy shooting um content for instagram and youtube so in my head it, it never really feels like work which i'm so lucky about but yeah i'm just waiting for my mom to get in the car i have brought a banana to snack on because i am so hungry i had avocado toast for breakfast it was actually Olivia Jade who made me crave it. I watched her Why Eat In A Day vlog and it, she reminded me that I haven't had avocado toast in so long. So yeah, I'm just gonna have a banana now. It's about four o'clock in the afternoon because I woke up at about 11 because I allowed myself to lie in. And then I did a workout. Then I like epiladied my whole body. If you guys don't know what that is, it's like basically like hair removal. But because I can't go to laser due to lockdown, um, I just did that instead. Um, and then I had a shower, dried my hair, did my makeup. So yeah, it's, it's four o'clock now. I'm just waiting for my mum. She's taking ages. Ironically, she was ready before me, but you guys know what mums are like. There's always stuff to do. Um, so I'm just gonna have the banana and wait till she comes. We are stuck in some major traffic, like all of North London is a traffic jam right now, um, which is crazy because it's locked up. Because it's everywhere. Yeah. And then my mum's like, where is everyone going? And I was like, they're probably thinking the same thing about you, mum. Where are you going? <laughs> so, yeah. But the weather is so beautiful, so I don't actually mind sitting in traffic. And as long as we are out, doesn't matter because anyway, everywhere is close. Yeah, you have to walk or we have to sit in the car. Yeah, exactly. So it's good. Hungry. Do you like water? No, nah, mercy. So we have managed to shoot two pictures, but the light is going down. So my mum and I have decided that two is the max for today and that we are going to go get some sushi now. Yes. <laughs> um, we'll probably shoot some more video, so some more pictures tomorrow. I'm filming a YouTube video with my mum and my dad as well. So I'll have my makeup done for that. So goals for the day. Um, how is weather tomorrow? Yeah, how is the weather tomorrow? Sunny. Oh, sunny. Yay, okay, so tomorrow is sunny as well. Yes. Yay, okay, I'm gonna order some sushi. We are in St. John's Wood currently, so I'm probably gonna order some sushi from um, Oka in Primrose Hill, and then maybe me and my mum can go and sit at the top of the park as oh, well. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, okay, so I'm gonna do that now. So we've come to Primrose Hill, and it's really pretty here. We've just parked the car. Oh my god. Oh no, that kid fell over. Um, we've seen so many people fall over today. It's actually crazy. We're gonna go to Oka in Primrose and get some sushi. There's a very long queue for Joe and the Juice. I'm not gonna lie, I really do not understand the hype. Um, tell me if there's something I'm missing out on, but I'm allergic to so much fruit anyway. <laughs> I'd never be a juice person. I'll be a mum, let's cross. And yeah, it's just so adorable here. So guys, there was a 30 minute wait at Oka and I was too hungry. So I've come to a um, sushi shop in Hampstead to get a takeaway because I'm just gonna be, it's much quicker, it's like 15 minute wait. And look, there's another Joe and the Juice here. What is up with Joe and the Juice? I, this one's closed, but like, honestly, what is this hype? I don't understand. Um, but yeah, I will tell you guys if the sushi's good. I'll show you as well. Secure the bag. So this is our sushi setup. We got the deluxe, no, 
I don't know, the something box for two. Um, and it just has like a variety of I'm stuff. Gonna so I'm going to eat it all alone. <laughs> um, no, I'm not going to eat it all alone, obviously. I'm going to eat it with my mum. Sina um, isn't going to eat because she had a chicken burger two hours ago. So she's not hungry. I'm going to watch some TV and just chill out a bit. Relax time. I'm actually starving, so I don't that even know. That looks so nice. It does. Huh? Yeah, I'm Ooh. so hungry. Hopefully this will film me. Guys, this is so good. I've already found a favorite. It is this one, and it's uh, salmon with cream cheese in I'll the middle. Find that one, yeah. It's so good. Signing is a fork <laughs> now, and she's stealing our sushi. Stop being, you've got so many here. Which one should I have? She tried this one, and I was really annoyed because that's my favorite Four one. It wasn't all that. I'm gonna try this one. Dip it in some sauce. We finished it all and it was sushi shop by the way that we had and it was beautiful Mommy, did you like it? Oh, I love it. It was really really delicious. Yeah, I like high quality I liked it a lot too Sina at like three of our pieces I had two. I'm joking. By the way guys, I'm joking when I say this in case some people think we're being serious Because I know some people will be like begging me to try it. Oh no, I got a spot. Oh no because I didn't wash off my makeup properly yesterday. It's my fault. Why do we get spots more during this lockdown, I feel? Because of masks. Mask, yeah, but I don't even leave the house, so I don't know why I get spots. Maybe because you don't get enough sunshine. I think sun really helps it clear your skin. So, guys, my mum is about to do my eyebrows because they're just a bit... Out of control. Also, I fell asleep with my makeup last night because I was so tired and I need to stop doing that. It's so bad for my skin. My skin overall is looking much better apart from this, which I'm happy about. Anyway, I will see you guys when I've got fresh eyebrows. Well, isn't this a dramatic change in the way I look? I am about to film my Opoly haul and I'm gonna get my parents to rig my outfits. The outfits are a bit, you know, sexy, um, little mini dresses and very like nice occasion wear outfits. So I thought it'd be fun to get my mum and dad to rate them. Also because I don't think my mum and dad would rate them the way the public would think they would rate them, if that makes sense. So I think it'll be a good watch. But yeah, I just did my makeup quite like heavy um, because I just think that the outfits are like night out outfits so you have to imagine it with the night out makeup. And also my eyebrows came out quite good but I've obviously like filled them in. Um, but yeah, they're, they're like symmetrical which is all I really care about even if I haven't drawn them on symmetrically. Oh well, it's what it is. Why, don't, why am I bending down? Okay, I'm gonna film this video and then probably shoot some pics so yeah, you'll see me when I finish. Hey guys, so today's Thursday. It is my day off before my set of nights. I'm gonna be on uh, evening, well, night shifts from 9 p.m. until 9.30 a.m. Friday, Saturday, Sunday through to Monday morning at 9.30. So today is Thursday, I've got the day off and I am going to go to Primrose Hill. Um, and then I am going to drop off um, a baby blanket outside um, my best friend's house. Um, so my best friend Mickey, if any of you guys watch the Manchester vlog, you'll know who she is. Her older sister Taylor and her partner Scott just welcomed a beautiful baby. Oh my god, he's so cute. I've just seen so many pictures and videos of him and I, I love him already and I probably stare at his pictures and videos for like I don't know, hours on end and just flick through my camera roll. I'm so excited. Um, so I'm just gonna drop this baby blanket that I got um, made for him um, to outside their house um, and maybe peek at the baby through the window. Um, as you guys could I really love babies and especially when it's like, you know, I just know he's like the first grandson, their family, it makes me so happy. Um, so yeah, he's like the first grandchild of their family and he's named after his grandpa and oh, I just can't guys, I just, oh, it's too adorable. Um, so yeah, I got him this blanket made that says baby Michael and his date of birth and I got it for any of you guys wondering um, from not on the 
northonthehighstreet.co.uk and it's got like it's a bit like Etsy but like the UK version and it's got loads of like different sellers and I just picked like the, the highest rated one so I'll show you the blanket actually because I need to buy a carrier bag for it so this is the blanket and here it says baby Michael 0103 2021 and at first I was thinking to buy him Nike tracksuits um, but then I just thought maybe it'll be cute if he had this and it was something that he like wore for life rather than something that he could only wear for three months so like as in you know like threw over him for life or kept with him uh, so that was my like thoughts and also I just thought you could personalize it so yeah I really hope they like it and that he hasn't got anything personalized yet um, so yeah I'll, I'll tell you guys uh, if they like it or not hopefully we will um, so yeah I'm just really really happy about that and it's just nice to have um, something so bright and amazing and such good news in especially like COVID times and stuff like I've been waiting for this baby to come since I found out about him in like August so yeah um, okay I'm gonna go now This dog is blocking me from my workout. He will not move from my mat and rubs himself against my leg. So as you can see, I'm on my night shift. It is 2 a.m. It's very quiet here in hospital um, in terms of sound. I'm just walking to go up to the fourth floor of my building um, to review a patient. Um, it's so weird at night time, like all the lights are off and stuff, so it's weird to be in a hospital, but nice. So, excuse how awful I look. <laughs> and me. I'm literally like trying to find a way I've to make it. myself look away. more presentable, but it's not happening. Basically, let me open it and show you. So, I've managed to get my hands on some little moons. Sol and I are going to try them out. If any of you guys aren't aware, there was a huge hype over these desserts to the point where they're sold out in literally every single supermarket. Oh my Sol god. Sol is trying the coconut one, which oh, is wow. the only flavour we have. Um, and it looks, it looks like this. So, mm -hmm. wow, it's so soft. <laughs> <laughs> so it's super soft and like gooey, like a marshmallow on the outside, right? And then you got an ice cream center, guys. It's so tasty and Moorish. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Mm. Worth the hype. Mmm. Yum. I love the calories for a little bowl. Though. Yeah, 83 calories for one bowl. That's it for me. Do you want another one? No, but you can get a whole Jude's ice cream on top of it. Mmm. For like 350. No, this is too good. You want one more? No. I'm not having one more. Are you having one more? No. So there's six in a pack, guys. How would you rate it out of 10? Mmm. I think, given that there's nothing like this, the closest thing like this is mochi, but mochi's shell is harder. This is like a goo. I really like it. I really like it too. I'd give it a 10. I could easily have the entire pack. Yeah, I could easily have the entire pack too. Take it, set it freezer. Yeah, I'm going to hide it in the freezer. We've got two packets, so let's see how fast or slow we get through these. Um, also, yeah, excuse the mess. I've come off nights. Um, today was my day off, and I spent my day off um, basically editing a YouTube video, doing a workout, doing so much like, you know, like paperwork stuff when it comes to being an F1. Like, there's a lot of stuff you need to get like signed off and this and that, and my audit just got approved, so I've already collected the data on it, so now I need to make a report of it. So it just got approved today, which I'm really happy about. So I'm just going to make the report for it. And yeah, um, that was some good news. And tomorrow I've got work again. So I will see you in the morning. So I'm just making my morning breakfast. It's like a smoothie bowl almost. Um, so I've got half an avocado, um, one whole banana, chia seeds, and then I'm going to add this chocolate soya milk 
and also one spoon of this peanut butter which by the way is the best peanut butter I've ever had I got it from the Turkish super shop super shop supermarket in my area so I'm just going to add literally that much because it is so rich the flavor of this adding about a hundred mils I think that looks like a bit more but with all the other ingredients I think that is about 100 to 150 mils just a quick outfit of the day I'm wearing this plain black Zara dress with tights I kind of have my slippers on but I'm going to change into black boots but this is what I'm wearing to work today this is my hair and my makeup I've got a little plaited pony and these little pink earrings so i'm gonna go off to work now also i just tried the breakfast and it tastes really good if any of you guys want to try it it's basically like the joe and the juice um smoothie but i that found the recipe from like courtney kardashian or something similar but yeah avocado smoothies are so yummy so my dad has made this amazing <laughs> breakfast omelette watermelon some this is from dishab yes yeah, yeah. yeah. This is chibesh we got in kufte. Yeah. What is it called? Cow chitab. Oh, cow chitab. That's it again. I forgot. I had a mind blank. Um, some yeah. honey, some bread, some gerdu, which is walnuts, some cheese, some tomato, some cucumber, some chef. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> Um, some and with the <laughs> hello, hello everybody. Um, basically, oh my god, I look so awful. I was just arguing with my mum because she was telling me off for walking on the carpet with my slippers. Yeah, and I was like, I give a damn point to get me to him real fast. Already, damn point, you're not sure because she did it. Because carpet is white, and white things when it's getting dirty is so. So why, why give, why do you force everyone to wear house slippers okay. so that you don't get cold feet when you walk on the marble? Yeah, but then what? So I'm meant to leave it on one area yeah. and then walk all the way back around. There's no point in it. Oh <laughs> no, but come on, that I'm not the princess. She's the princess. Why? She wants to look after her things. Nah, I don't agree. So that's why I'm not showing Sol's face because she's clearly not making think? a good point. <laughs> good, don't show my face because I've got massive style. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm gonna show your face. So it is Sunday today. It's Mother's Day, and this video is also going live in like an hour. So I thought I would end this vlog here, and I want to wish all of you guys um, and your mums or your mother-like figures, or if you are a mum, I want to wish you a happy Mother's Day. And honestly, my mum is probably the most important person to me in my whole life and i can't imagine my life without her or who i would be without her and i'm sure that a lot of you guys feel the same way about your own mums and so yeah i think it's a wonderful day to celebrate and i hope you have a wonderful day with your family i'm going to spend mine with my family so i'm just going to end the vlog here now and spend the rest of the day with my family and just enjoy mother's day together i love you guys so much and i'll see you in my next vlog bye